Hey, what's going on today? I am going to show you Evato tethering. So I got my trusty tethering cable here. So let's go. We're gonna actually get it and put it in the um, camera. I'm using a Sony A7R5. So we're gonna go ahead and put the dandy cable in here, handy cable in here. And we're going to go ahead and put this right here with our camera. So I'm at a conference, as you can see, we're doing multiple headshots and I wanna try Evoto AI for tethering. So let's see how it works and let's go right over here and jump over to the software. All right, so I'm going to open up a new project and then I'm just gonna call this tether. Test. Then I'm gonna hit tethered shooting. I'm gonna make sure that my camera is on, which it is on. And then I'm going to make sure I hit tethered shooting. This is my first time using it. So project is empty. Wow, it automatically shows exactly what I need. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to do a test real quick and we'll do a tethered shoot and see how it works right here in Evato. And we, we're gonna look and do a couple of test shots right here the tether capture and there it is you can look right here all right when I bring it in here I can do all of the stuff I can do the changes it looks like I can it shows up set up auto power off and I see battery level everything and I can control it right from here yep there it is I can control it right from there tethered shooting so that's what I did for tethered shooting in a Voto it's my first time ever trying it tell me what you think in the comments hopefully you'll be using it and you use it part of your workflow All right now I'm using capture one for almost everything but hey Evoto capture one we'll see Lightroom Tell me what you think in the comments below.